right uh, video lesson four okay we'll talk about the covalent bonding for molecule of compound all right molecules of compound okay the word compound meaning uh, it's a uh, um, combinations of two of more than two atoms that is from a uh, different types of uh, atom meaning um, the combination is not from the same type of atom so example that we are going to look at today is water water actually is formed by two hydrogen atom combined with one oxygen atom now from the um, periodic table hydrogen atom have one proton okay and there's only one electron at the outermost layer as for oxygen oxygen actually have um, eight proton okay so meaning at the outermost layer oxygen will have 2.6 meaning six electron at the outermost layer okay and um, let's just recap quickly what is the purpose of forming covalent bonding or sharing of electron okay the purpose of form covalent bonding basically is to achieve the electronic configuration EC eh? configuration electronic confi like a noble gas now what is the electronic configuration for noble gas um, as you can uh, recall uh, there's only two type one is uh, we call it duplet duplet meaning the shell have maximum two electron duplet eh? okay two electron another or uh, we call them as um, octet okay octet is meaning there are eight electron at the uh, outermost shell okay so let's uh, um, go back to our h2o so h2o hydrogen okay started from hydrogen we only show the uh, outermost layer for covalent bonding we have one electron at the outermost layer okay one electron and uh, oxygen plus one oxygen plus one oxygen atom oxygen okay oxygen is two six right so we have six electron at the outermost layer so we can draw like this uh, oxygen um, we can use cross two four okay and then five here and then six okay and then plus another atom oxygen ah sorry another atom hydrogen so another atom hydrogen so we use dot okay for hydrogen okay so this is one electron from hydrogen one electron from hydrogen this side and six electron of uh, oxygen so we are talking about outermost layer so in drawing of the covalent bonding we don't have to draw all the layer we just focus on the outermost layer all right so when they combine this is the result so as i said in the previous lesson when you form a covalent bonding you must draw the overlapping area draw out the overlapping area so this is your hydrogen okay this is your hydrogen Okay, so this one electron from hydrogen will share with another electron from oxygen so that it will form, uh, we call it duplet, meaning two, eh? like a noble gas configuration, noble gas, electronic configuration. Eh? So you have one dot here, okay, and you have one cross. This cross is from oxygen. Okay, so oxygen we have here. Okay, and um, another hydrogen also. Hydrogen, uh, sorry, hydrogen here, and then electron from oxygen. All right, that's all. This is uh, what you will see the uh, one of the dot and cross uh, diagram. Another way to draw the dot and cross diagram actually, uh, you can draw like this. Okay, this is your oxygen atom okay and there are um, <coughs> ok 
okay cross and then one cross here another cross is here all right then it will share with hydrogen one electron from hydrogen where hydrogen we can draw like that and then another hydrogen here okay then you can draw like that okay this is also another form of a dot and cross diagram now if you can see there are two single bond okay or two sharing of electrons you can see two sharing of electron two sharing one pair one pair of ele shared electron shared electron so meaning you will form a single bond single covalent covalent bond bonding okay so in the structural formula you can write one oxygen atom one line connecting to one hydrogen another line connecting to another hydrogen why one line because of the one pair of shared electron representing by a single covalent bonding which can be represented by one line okay that's all for this lesson